British King Charles is a lousy liar. He'd love to lie, but don't know how. Doesn't know how to. Wants to look cool, but is losing his mind on lice this video here is real this is good video there's only one thing I am gonna do now I am gonna upgrade claim for his prostate surgery upgrade from 2016 to 2012 so I'm changing the dates from 2016 to 2012, maybe 2013, but I don't think so. Maybe, all right, maybe 2013, maximum. He would love to lie, but doesn't know how. Wealthy people are lousy liars. It's because they have a lot of people do job instead of them. I don't think they are even accountable for the stuff they do anymore. He would love to lie but doesn't know how. This is the article Charles released today. As a matter of fact, it came out this on February the 2nd of 2024. I'm surprised that he is still advertising this stuff because I've seen this like a, under the Royals, like a main news, like a main headline, and today already is February the 4th, 2024, so, so noticeable in mainstream media as a headline that I was sure that this was a news of the day. It says here, real reason King Charles gave unprecedented surgery that they is laid bare by palace insider. There's no fucking reason. I'm gonna I'm gonna explain to you what the truth behind this stuff is. Sometimes in uh, 2011. Charles alone, not with William, visited a physician. He's got some physician, I remember, same physician. He's got like maximum two physicians that are his like number one physicians. And then it breaks down to other physicians. But actually it's like a one main physician, two maximum physicians that... Everything about Charles goes through them. And so in 2012, Charlie asks his physician, like, yes, yes, obviously about the surgery. Yes, yes, but what am I going to do with him? Having me with him in his...
in the place of the visit in his hospital, if you want, whatever. It might have been even 2011, I don't know. 2011 or 2012. And it's why I know it was done in 2012. Because the Einstein, the doctor of Charlie, his personal doctor, learned how to use the pace book. So I come up with the idea that he's going to actually, uh, actually do something about it. He became determined. Might have been 2011. So surgery, I upgrade the claim to 2012, not even 2013, when William started to instigate that I don't care about his father and this, that I'm insensitive and so on. It's quite really insane because really in 2013, already for about a year, I was dealing with a psychiatric hospital which they hired to get me killed for already a year, eating pills that were literally destroying my liver, my kidney. And it's even something that Charles becomes to began to gesture in 2015 that he realized just how bad that stuff was actually for me. Like physically destroying my body. And it's why that he decided. <clears throat> he didn't decide a fucking nothing. He didn't do anything. He didn't do a fucking thing. I ran from one country to another across the Europe. Slept at times, lived out on a field under a fucking sky, out in the open on the grass, like a deer. On a train, bus stations. Sometimes, at times, I had to forget about the sleep. And we just have to march forward like it was for instance on my way to Belarus so that I would avoid basically a complete brain functional brain functionality blockout exhaustion fucking death don't know how to explain you otherwise It's like plain and simple, most, when you walk days without the sleep, when you're all fucked up from one place to another. And it's quite amazing the way I managed to actually even recover from the psychiatric pills. People were amazed that I managed to function one day with the psychiatric pills which I was taking for I don't know how long, and then cut them short, and then I managed actually to go without any mental problems, and not once, but on several occasions, because Slovenia had police and courts dispatch after me. Nurses basically come home checking on my psychiatric pills, supplies, and stuff like that. <clears throat> so a doctor, a physician, wanted to make sure that Charlie would have a proof, in fact, he would have done something with a Facebook, he claimed. He's going to do something with a Facebook. I record what? Charles on a fucking Facebook? Good luck with the Facebook. Facebook, this is like medical files. This is... When it comes to Facebook, I am not going to get into it, but 
I already did now that I shouldn't. There is nothing on a Facebook that cannot be done apart from the Facebook by the Facebook. I mean, this is virtual world with Mr. Zuckerberg who participated here. He never missed, I think, a single MK Ultra session. God knows how many times he participated in this house here as a guest. If I didn't go visit him. You know, the people, these people meet on frequent basis, the CEO executives of the companies. And also give them technology. If they deem that they would represent them in a way they want. So the cancer I was talking about must have been done already in 2012. You might see, since so that was posted on February the 2nd, and I posted this, let's see that, on January the 31st, you might see something publicly from Charlie that it eventually would go on his news to assure you know, some stunt something God knows what that in fact it was done just lightly I also would warn you about something else but there is several also why I know that Charles did not have surgery now. Charles claimed would do surgery, that it was not. He started to claim in 2013, 2014, William was the one who started to hype with this issue. 2015, they again brought about this subject, about surgery subject. And a physician, a doctor, his physician, his doctor, began to, well, I actually might even go and look for the picture. I should have done that earlier already before. Um, to demonstrate you what his physician looks like. But his physician reminded in 2000 and. He was not a really a nice person, this guy. He used to be a nice person. But in 2015, beginning the 2011, 2012, he was nothing nice about this guy no more. He was really a piece of work, if you ask me. He started to instigate again on a virtue of Facebook, that he's going to have something through the Facebook, that he's definitely going to have a proof discouraging basically to attempt for me to do something like this I record video eventually portion of it on his surgery prostate surgery started to instigate also that it was in 2015, 2016, when taking me to his clinic, to his hospital, then in fact it was not emergency, that it was not emergency. He said there was not emergency, that, but in 2014, that he would do this, William started the story, but father doesn't want, and he went on to suggest that he would do this, but it's, that's not emergency, that he had some other surgeries done, that kind of stuff. Therefore, in 2011, 2012, what kind of surgery is, I have no fucking idea. Um, that this one here is going to have to be, uh, at his request, the request of Charles postponed. And in 2016, Charlie started to visit Hungary at large. Not Hungary, but Hungary. 
hungry, hungry like a state, hungry, not hungry, but hungry. Magyar, Magyaros. Magyarska, we say in Slovenia. Look, and began to coordinate with the Hungarian Postal Services what in front of me he began to instigate. Let's try it again. Patience is a virtue. But Charlie never had any fucking patience. I have it. And I say patience is a virtue because he was driven insane. He was driven nuts with my being patient, with my being prudent, with my avoiding crazy statements, crazy stuff. It was this watch that came to his hands. They became completely crazy about it. Oh, the price went up to 36 euros. Well, that's a decent sale. I mean, it went, it went, it, it went really, really up, steep up. So, he went on, got this watch in his hands, exactly this watch in his hands. Maybe I do have impact on AliExpress, who knows? And started to insist me by showing me this watch during MK Ultra. This is a really cheap watch. Started to insist me during MK Ultra that, in fact, you know, if you put the price to $36, then I will want my part from this company's name. If it's a, such a good business and it's so picked up, then I have something to do with it. Fine. Looking forward to. He went on to insist me that if I would order the watch like this, knowing that would come through Hungary, Hungarian Postal Services, right now, Charles made a big fucking mistake here. What year is it now? What year is it? time if you wanted to fuck me you couldn't even call you a liar it's not against the law to call you a liar if you're a liar proven liar it's 2024 oh look February the 4th well how the fuck would I know if not thanks to Charlie Charlie that this watch, if one was to arrive to Slovenia, would literally have to enter through the Hungary any bit. Obviously by this company here, which is Skmay Store. It obviously they did this already in 2016. But I'm not sure. If Charlie would be capable to prove at the same time, yeah, because I already hear Charlie saying, well, you know, this was uh, a company, whatever, you know. He was, but not in Slovenia, I think. In Slovenia, I think in 2016, one express did not exist yet. That's your fucking problem, Charlie. Even if you would say that, well, you know, so I had no fucking way to know this would come to Hungary. The one whoever would know how this would come in 2024 to Slovenia, and that actually, again, is through the Hungary, would be you, mister. And I think AliExpress, in Slo um, One Express in Slovenia, I think it only exists for a lousy two years or something like that. Let's check it out. Oh, 
Oh, wow, look. These guys are actually registered in Kamenda, Ljubljana. I think this is in Ljubljana, but I mean, to come pray. This is a location I already have identified. Owners, employees. Oh, look at that. Shit. This is year 2022. Obstop of Slovenia, Pravio, Pri Austriski, Posti. The Austrian Postal Services, Österreichische Post, from July 4 through the daughter, daughterly company, Express One, in Slovenia is delivering packages by itself oh my god so if i understand this properly if i understand this properly this company express one it exists in slovenia since 2022 Austrijska pošta je letati 2020 za korijenske spresne paketve in tako naprej. Ja, they have been everywhere. I am not really sure about what is it here, even Slovenia or whatever, in 2020. I don't think so, they were in 2020. I don't think anywhere near what I hear in 2016. As a matter of fact, 2015. But it appears to me the packages still were coming through the Hungary if you order this watch here. Because Charlie knew. Charlie knew how this is going to come to Slovenia through the Hungary. Charles came up with idea, delivering me to Budapest in 2015, 2016, 2017, 2018, 2019. Boy, was he busy with the mayor of the Budapest. Boy, were you busy with the mayor of the Budapest, claiming me in front of the mayor of the Budapest, claiming me in front of Viktor Orban, claiming me in front of executives at Hungarian Postal Services based in Budapest, that my watch would be modified, that my watch would not be the original watch I would order, and so on and so forth. Boy was Charlie, Charlie boy, busy with this particular watch. What happened? Charlie went on to insist me on opportunity in England, in Hungary, Slovenia, 
that once I order this watch, it would be when he would go to have a surgery for the prostate against the prostate cancer. And that he would postpone and would fucking postpone and would wait. My asking him, Charlie, why, Charles, come on. Are you going to go and risk your head? I mean, wait or spawn something dangerous? I even got scared for him. You know, I would actually wear this watch, and he was like, it's going to pay off. It's going to pay off. I will. You know, if I would not know this guy, if I would not know this guy, I would actually even believe, you know, but because I know this guy, how deeply he fears for his life, because I know what is inside of his pants, because I know him better than his mama and his papa, because I know him better than anyone, I doubt it that he went on and did the surgery, I don't know, two weeks ago, whatever. When was it written that he did the surgery? On January the 17th, Palace informed the public that he was due to undergo corrective treatment for enlarged prostate. Okay. January the 7th, 2024. Holy fuck. That actually fits the scenario that I just gave you. It's accurate. I hope, I hope for, just like the watch I'm about to receive. That watch is supposed to go plus and minus a physical of very, very tolerance. Tolerance, uh, Within, I don't know, a month. If it's not going to go like this, sure the watch is going to go back. A little scratch. Tiniest little scratch and the watch is going to go back. Anything fucking wrong with the watch and watch is going to go back. I'm going to open the watch. Check the fucking watch. See in and out how it is. And or it will go back. For anything on a belt, any fucking strange thing, any little shit, it's gonna go back. This is because if you're gonna continue to take side with absolute evil, I'm gonna start to take my fucking side and start to break balls so I can get. Whatever the fuck I pay. It is simple as this. I'm not going to be fucking hiding. From pain for the fucking watch. Or pain for the socks. Or pain for whatever the fuck I have to pay. This one here. Is a strange fellow. Is a strange bird. Because. He even found funny watches he liked. From AliExpress. And would secretly wear them. But not publicly. That's what I call funny bird. 
He is a fan of the proper English. A cup of tea. To the degree that he would sip your poison in your coffee to prove you wrong about the coffee effects. That's positive. That's all I gotta say for this stuff. We're gonna do this, and we're gonna do this. So I think I did prove the case here. You do understand. You do understand Express One did not exist in Slovenia until 2022, you do. No, this is just Express One. But it doesn't say Express One Slovenia. It must say Slovenia here, because this is a branch of Express One in Slovenia that operates not exactly independently. Until 2021, there was no Express One in Slovenia. You see this? That's a little faster, easier way to prove there was no express one in Slovenia. Yeah, it's AliExpress service in Slovenia, but not Express One Slovenia. So that was the case. He is again lying. And I don't like to see how he's gonna present his case. His proof about, as per prostate can prostate cancer surgery, and not that I wish one to have. I wouldn't wish any of this to any people. That's up to God to decide. He made decisions about me. He acted like a god. He was a god. He came on a picture like a god. He was gonna he played God. He wanted to look like a god. That's what he did, this man to me. And I never wish anybody anything like this. So it's in the hands of God. I find it pathetic. And all that other good stuff I wouldn't waste my brain on. There is no fucking real reason. More lies from Buckingham Palace. I just realized what a mistake I have made. In respect to the video I have posted online and that will be the video I dedicated to King Charles in respect to his prostate cancer surgery it's the video I quickly corrected into the statement As seen here, which, however, I have even used contrary to what is written here to submit claim how this watch, in fact, always was delivered to Slovenia. Therefore, beginning the 2015, when the watch production was released, how this watch always was delivered to Slovenia through Hungary, through the Budapest as a point of entry. The European Union that it was always Hungarian Budapest that was used as an entry point to Europe and from within distributed to Slovenia uh, this was a very wrong statement I have made and it's thanks to memory only that I learned just as I published a video that I recalled 
that this particular watch did not enter Slovenia from Hungary at absolutely any time, I was told, by Slovenian people. Till at least 2018. Some claim me even 2019 and so on. 2018, 2019, that this watch started to enter Slovenia. After three or four years at least, randomly, seldomly, it would enter to Slovenia. Also, through Hungary, through the Budapest. I was told repeatedly that this watch arrived to Slovenia through Germany. Even was suggested through Vienna because I was trying to smell the information from where, from where, from where. So, this is to clarify that what I was going to use as an evidence for Prince Charles delivering me repeatedly beginning the 2016 to Budapest to entry point into European Union, for which is Budapest is used for many countries if importing mail from China, such as AliExpress or eBay, for many countries, for many items, uh, Chinese would use Hungarian postal services as an entry point to European Union. And from within, that will be redistributed to whatever country it was intended for. And for this particular watch, as much as Prince Charles brainwashed me, 2015, 2016, 2017, 2018, 2019, he would deliver me to the Hungary, to the Budapest, where he would accent in front of Hungarian postal services, in front of the mayor of Budapest, on when, if I would order this watch, if I would order this watch, it would be Hungarian postal services that would have watch basically confiscated. I would not get this watch. You know, this watch would literally go through his hands and within the watch, in fact, would be whatever done with the watch. He took total responsibility for it. Yeah? When, in fact, now King Charles have, as a Prince Charles, negotiated first with this individual here. This is a Slovenian Prime Minister who was my case manager. He never was my case manager. He was only a case manager from Slovenia in charge for a genocide against me, for a genocide case against me. Prince Charles negotiated Delivery of this watch through the future, future delivery of this watch through Hungarian postal services as an entry point to European Union from where watch would enter Slovenia would be Budapest. He demanded this from this guy. And this guy went on to negotiate this issue through the case manager number four, which was she beginning the 2016 beginning the 2017 2016 Charles in 2017 he got confirmed that Slovenian government in fact will arrange what would become direct import to Slovenia for this particular item, for this watch.
from Hungary, from the Budapest. I cannot go in fire and make statement, make claim that this is the way it is and so on and so forth. I cannot do this. I cannot do that. I cannot do any of that stuff. I cannot do that stuff. I cannot do this stuff. What is this here? 11. And this one here is 35. Yeah, this is the one I ordered. All right, that's nice. So the price changed for the item I ordered. I cannot go and guarantee for this kind of issues because it's hard to know who lied and who did not. According to Slovenian side, this watch did not enter Slovenia. I'm going to say even until 2019, anywhere from Hungary, seldomly if it entered to Slovenia from random AliExpress or eBay seller that would use services, uh, Hungarian services for this item as an entry point to Slovenia. One Express did not exist in Slovenia. One Express Slovenia did not exist until 2022, just as you're about to see in the video. And therefore, One Express Slovenia began to exist in Slovenia, literally through demand, possibly literally through demand of Prince Charles, now King Charles, using this particular watch. So he basically used this watch because One Express is affiliated with the Austrian Postal Services. He used this watch to introduce in Slovenia One Express, Express One. Slovenia. So I see that he was using me for some other business related issues, maybe even on behalf of some other people, God knows, where the order for this type of scam came from. Maybe it came from Austrian postal services, maybe who knows what, how they desired, who desired what. And they couldn't get in here, so they were using this kind of item to get in here or whatever. That was a frequent thing to do for Prince Charles, no King Charles. It's a scammer and a lousy liar. Therefore, nothing changes in respect to the video except the claim I had made. And the claim I had made was wrong about how this watch always traveled beginning the 2015 therefore when the watch was released that this watch always traveled to Slovenia through Hungary no it did not it was arranged according to MPO scenario finally finalized arranged agreed upon in 2017 that this watch in the future in fact would be delivered to Slovenia through Hungary, through the Budapest. Obviously, through what would become Express One in Slovenia, Express One Slovenia. That's Austrian mail services. So I need to fix that issue. That was the mistake I have made. I would not bet in any of it. In fact, I was even told by Slovenian people that. In respect to his future prostate cancer surgery, that I should absolutely not make any statements because they would be used to screw me up. The Slovenian side even told me this, they advised me about that kind of issue. When, in fact, during the video, as you have noticed, I have made claim that the latest, according to a new claim, I am making the latest 
date when Prince Charles made cancer surgery must have been at least 2013 and more even more likely so 2012 it was either 2012 or 2013 just as I stated in the video so this is the only thing that I need to correct is just to what I was going to use as a proof was actually created based on predictability, brainwash. Charles is a fan of psychiatry. That can be seen also from this case that he was using a predictable logic, police logic, in fact, on how he would trap me with this. But yeah, thanks to memory, I recall that until 2019, you heard me? Until 2019, this watch would not enter, based on Slovenia, Slovenia told me, would not even enter Slovenia from Hungary. It was always Germany or Vienna, I was told, it would enter. So, I don't know how much is the true in it, I don't know which side light, this was the Slovenian side that presented me with this issue, which Charles also was present. I have to tell you that. And Charles alone insisted on something else. He insisted that he would be from Hungary, absolutely. Already, this would make it interesting that he would be from Hungary since 2016. He would travel to Hungary, where he would threaten me that even this watch, when I would order one, it will not be the watch that I would order, that he would switch the watch with some other watch and so on. Just as I stated, 2016, 2017, 2018, 2019, repeatedly with me, with me, having me along, would travel to Hungary, to Budapest, to assure me about that issue. Maybe he wanted... To play divide and conquer. Slovenian side, I'm sure, more than willing to lay down and open its legs, bow down to a king. But this is not Slovenian king. This is a fucking nobody in my lexicon, in my vocabulary. Just as it stated in the title. Nothing more than a lousy liar. And if Slovenian side lied, so that only makes two. Which one of the two lied more? I don't care. I wouldn't even ask myself. 